What's happening, good people? It's your boy, Crazy Crack House. I'm back with another review. Uh, really just a conversation uh, about a shoe that I just got in hand. And it will be the Air Jordan 5, Fire Red. The uh, reason why I'm doing the video on it, I've watched a thousand on foot. Uh, you know, many guys that, you know, for the last week or two been posting that shoe. Uh, but I think that, you know, when I really got a good look at the shoe, she was an incredible shoe for the guys who missed on it. But I just want to let you show, just do it. Uh, they dropped in the mail today to me. And that was fast, man, because, you know, I just won on Air Max Day, the evolution of Icon, which I put up a video just talking about some general stuff on the shoe. It's on my page, you know, hit the like button hit the subscribe you know i'm gonna be putting up a lot of different videos of you know any type of exclusive shoe that i get like if i watch somebody video and they miss some on it you might be a little on the fence about the shoe you know maybe one detail you know because it's so hard to get to go in the store and look at shoes anymore and 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 right about now they bet they, they're getting ready to x that out you know all the shoes are going to be going on draws and raffles they probably isn't going to be any more walking in the mall and getting a shoe no more man and and it's for real you know if you look on the sneakers app and right now you know they got the jordan 11 on the drawer and what the hell is that you know every shoe that's coming out you know they're drawing it that og1 north carolina that that comes out saturday that shoe is going to be near to impossible for anybody to obtain if you think you're gonna walk in a mall and grab that off the shelf, that ain't happening. You know, they've already pulled every raffle for men's sizes. They only got grade school on Foot Locker and Champs and uh, Hibbets is probably one of the only stores that have men's sizes. And Hibbets is not everywhere. To me, the closest Hibbets is freaking in, in, in the corner of Jersey and I'm not driving all the way to Jersey for no pair of kicks. You know, I don't give a damn if they're two thousand dollars in the aftermarket. I'm not a reseller. You know, I really buy shoes for my comfort and 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 to wear myself and have the love of it. My, you know, my love for shoes is really real. So that's why I'm telling you that this shoe. If anybody think they're just gonna go online and get it, good luck. They pulling names out the hat. You know, so if your name get pulled out the hat, please run to your local. A lottery center and and please play the lotto because you're a lucky motherfucker if you win that but i'm gonna go into a short check out of these fives as you can see i do had a lot and i'm in the box this box is really real anyway i just showed you the nike box i don't play around when it comes to sneakers i'm dead serious about kicks and you know and if you really look at the detail in the shoe you can see that it's a it's an incredible shoe, man. I'm, I'm talking about until I had it, I got it in hand today. You know, I'm like, wow, I couldn't really believe it. And they they actually spent the extra couple of dollars, man. And that that material is incredible. Probably a thousand guys will argue with me, but you know, after playing around with this shoe in my hand and really feeling it. I think this shoe may have the, the original shoe, to be honest with you. I think this shoe may have the original shoe. And the one thing, I don't know what they did to it, but this is, is, is not heavy. Most number fives, you know, I don't know what everybody collection is. You know, me personally, I'm a number one and a number three, but I mix the numbers up if something crazy come out. But, you know, cause I have the fly knit number four that came out three years ago and it was made out of the same red man and i have them in the closet i've only had them on one time in the last three years my rotation is is really behind man and i knew to, i need to do more wearing and less buying but how can you man we got hit with this pandemic and this shit is going crazy and people are going crazy to buy shoes that they can't even wear no more in hopes that once the pandemic is over they'll have a closet full of hot kicks because that's basically what it's going to end up being me personally i'm staying in the bubble into further notice 
So, you know, I come on and just talk about a kick that everybody else is talking about. And I just like to go a little more into it and, and let you see, you know what I mean? This shoe is an incredible shoe. Ah, and they got that Nike smell. That's what's most important. But my son had these on and he loves them. And I think this is probably one of my greatest, uh, this is probably one of my greatest Nike hits uh, to the test of time. You know what I mean? Like this shoe is incredible. And if you would get an opportunity to buy this shoe, purchase this shoe, um, I would recommend that you do it. You know, right now, StockX is pretty high. You know, for this shoe I'm holding in my hand, it's probably over $200. Me, personally, if I had to pay $200 for my son's pair of shoes, he probably wouldn't have got them. Because he at that point where his feet is growing, and I do buy him pairs, like, you know, here and there. I mix him up. You know, but now his foot has been at a steady pace. I've been buying him a few pairs here and there, but... His size, if you get anything in the four to seven, God bless America in the last eight months, if you can even obtain that in New York, because we're only raffle and online. So you're going to take a L or a W and ain't no in between. You know, I do not buy from resellers. I don't buy from StockX. It would have to be the most incredible shoe in my life. And for me, uh, the only shoe that I'm still on the fence about but it went back up is the Air Jordan 11 Adapt uh, because I own probably, um, I would like to say at least three pair of them. And I think it's an incredible shoe and I will keep buying them. You know, a lot of people have slept on that shoe. The price is pricey, but they're your feet also. And one day you're going to get old and you're going to need those feet. So keep your head up, man. Love your loved ones and love the people that love you and stay safe in them streets, man, because it's hard out there. You know what I mean? Don't live above your means. Don't live within your means. So you'll be all right. But get the things you like in life because tomorrow ain't promised. Peace.